far getting on my nerves. How do I got coming in? No. Okay. Um. <clears throat> oh goodness. It's Ashley. Yeah. Yeah, I'm ready. She can come back. Okay. I'm Ashley. I'll be your case manager. Yeah, just have a seat right there. Perfect. So, how you doing? Good? Perfect. So, I understand that you're looking for assistance with uh, food stamps. Yeah? Okay. So, I'm going to have you... Um, so you've already submitted, one second, excuse me, <clears throat> smell alcohol, oh it's hand sanitizer, yeah that's why you smell alcohol, that's, yeah, you know COVID, all that, <laughs> so, okay. So I got your online application here. It says you have two children. Is that correct? Okay. What are their names just for verification reasons? So we have Jaden and Daughtry. Okay, perfect. That's an awesome name. How'd you come up with that? Perfectly. I love that. That was such a nice name. Daughtry. It's just like so cool. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah. So I need you to. <clears throat> so I have a list that I need you to. Um, I know that they told you to bring certain, uh, paperwork with you. Uh, most people don't come with the correct paperwork. I'll try to process your application today. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and do the list for you. Uh, give me one second. <clears throat> did you um did you bring your ch um children's uh birth certificates you did okay perfect i need those so just put them right there in my, uh, my little file shelf there. <laughs> yeah. Okay, thank you. 
Let's see. Yes. Um, it was food the only assistance I needed. Did you need assistance with housing, Section 8 housing, or any other like utility help, any other services that we do offer? No. Okay, just food, food stamps. Perfect. And you you have two dependents. Um so yeah, and then I need two pieces of mail to verify your address that you're currently living at. So you just drop it right there. And then um, I'm gonna need three of your pay stubs um, within a two month period, okay? And just put those in there. And then uh, your ID and your social, social security card. <clears throat> All right, uh, you couldn't find your social security card. Okay. Um, we You know, I'm pretty lenient on stuff. Do you, did you bring anything else? You brought your birth certificate? Okay, just, that'll work. That's fine. Just put that in there as well. Thank you. Oh my God, my phone rings off the hook. I'm so sorry. Ashley? Yeah? What happened? Really? Why do I have to be audited? Because I've been doing things wrong. Per who? Oh. Listen, listen, I'm with a client right now, so call me back in about 30 minutes. Okay, thanks. Bye-bye. Okay, um, so yeah, just, that's all your paperwork. Perfect. So, I'm going to have you fill out, Oops. I need you to fill out this survey here, put, um, <clears throat> put that I did everything right. Uh, you feel very, um, that I helped you with everything that you did, okay? And I put all check marks, yeah. And then if you do that, then I'll, I'll get you food stamps, okay? Just fill this out, okay? So let's have a look, see. So, what's going on as far as your, uh, your income? Did you have an issue 
as far as like natural disasters, um, the loss of your job, uh, what exactly uh, affected you in this need of assistance? Sorry. I know that's so hard. Oh, you're brave. You're so brave. I could never. I could never. Literally, wow. You are a rock star. I could not. Yeah, just put, put all check marks. Thank you. So, <clears throat> I'm taking from that information you're a single parent. Yep. From your, uh, what's the word? The, your hospital, the hospital that you went to, did they give you, <clears throat> like, discharge papers, uh, results, medical results, things of the sort? No? Perfect. Okay. Let's do this. And just put those there as well. Do you need help with child care? So what I'm going to do is just automatically um, select my need child care. And then from there, if any of the facilities that we approve um, work for you, then it's no issue, uh, you know, us assisting you and with that financially so that you can get back up on your feet and um, find another job it'll, it'll it helps i know it's a lot right now especially with everything that you've gone through uh, so yeah definitely does, does that sound good yeah okay i'll put you down This phone, it rings up, but I'm so sorry. Ashley.
What's the case number? Hold on. Okay, what is it? What's the name of it? Daniel. Okay. What was the error? Yeah, well, she only had two check stubs because um, she hasn't had a job. So what am I supposed to submit? She doesn't have three. Okay. Okay. Okay, what's the phone number on that? So you want me to get the third we because we normally only do three within the two month period. That's why I still submitted the case. Well, I hope she has the third one. I mean, you know how diff- Okay. I'll get it figured out, thanks. All right, bye-bye. I swear, it's always something. I'm so sorry. <clears throat> Sometimes I get really busy here, and um, there's, I can't, I'm literally just trying to help people, and they, it's like, every week, I have to go to a meeting, and they're like, Ashley, this is not what ma. You know what I mean? You ever had a job like that? No. Girl, I'm about to quit this job. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, um, okay. So, you did the, thank you. Perfect. We're gonna put that there. Okay, I'm gonna make a quick phone call, if you don't mind. Hey, it's Ashley. Hey, it's so good to hear. Yeah. Okay. So hey, okay, I have um, 
a case where they're asking for um um they they're wanting a bird check stuff but the client only has two when I submitted the case and approved it. Yeah. They, uh, they just told me that, that, um, I need to go ahead and pause the case. Um, and I'm gonna have to call them and let them know that they need to bring in a third check stat. But they don't have one. So what am I supposed to do? It was Becky. Yeah, she was the one. I know. I can't. I can't. You know I work so freaking hard. And it's like every time something. Okay. I appreciate it. So the name is Bennett. And uh, the number, the case number. Just give me a call back. All right, Michael, bye. Sorry about that. <laughs> I had to get some stuff handled from the upper department. Okay, so let's finish your application. See if you're approved. Did you file your tax return last year? You did? Oh, I see you submitted it. Sorry. Let me check here. So it's in here, if you just look over real quick, let me have some hands. Okay, so you see right here, it's saying that you claim three, three dependents. So you have a third child. No. Okay. So that was a mistake. I mean, it shouldn't be an issue. Yeah, I'll, um, I'll put in a request for an error edit on this tax return. So let's, uh, I can try with all my might with as much power as they give me here. What's that clause? What's that clause? Oh, you know, come on. Um, I 
have to look up the label number of uh, the tax Why is Becky emailing me? Oh my god. Okay. I'm so sorry. Give me a second. Well. Do you need assistance with school supplies or clothes? Okay, you got help from memory. Okay, perfect. Um, so I'm gonna give you a temporary, um, not a temporary, but an urgency food food coupon so you can go to the food bank and get you some food just gonna write your case number All right, just give them that at the food bank. And then um, though you're automatically approved since I put you as an urgency case to move it forward faster because you do have two dependent. Um, so, and especially with the school starting, you know, you wanna have, you wanna have food it's difficult with these times, so I'm just trying to help people. But yes, go to the food bank. You have $120 that you can spend, so you choose what you need, and you get every cent and dime. Got that? Yeah. Okay, so just take that coupon, and then... um I have your case submitted, but it's gonna take uh, probably a month. We're a little bit overloaded. I apologize, I'm so sorry. We're overloaded with cases now. Um, so I give it almost two months. I'm so sorry, almost two months. You know what, call my cell phone number don't don't call my work <laughs> don't call my extension 
because I already get enough calls. I promise. I'm sorry. But if you text me, call me on my cell phone. That's how you'll get a hold of me faster, okay? And then I'll get you another um, coupon because it's probably going to take about two months. And I'm sorry. They only let us do 120 maximum with the coupon. But call next month so I can give you another one, okay? I'm telling you this a lot. Thank you for your paperwork. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that in your file. Uh, okay, so do you have about... It's going to be about like 20 minutes after I make copies and send those off. Uh, and then I'll give them to the receptionist and she'll give you your documents back and make a follow-up date for an appointment with me, okay? You're, you're so welcome. You're welcome. It is nothing at all. Nothing at all at all. People need help. And to be honest, I don't even know if they're listening. Kind of scares me. Um, it's like they're so against helping people. Like what, that was the whole purpose of me like choosing this job was to like help people. And it's like they want me to have so many, um, what's it called, deny so many cases per month, it's insane, oh, you have to pick your kit, I'm sorry, I don't mean to hold you up, no, uh, go ahead, I'll, um, go ahead back to the waiting room, and it's that door over there, you see it? right there and uh it'll take you back to the waiting room and then they'll call you up to the window uh to give you your documents back and you'll be all good just make up that follow-up appointment and if you need help sooner that's my uh, personal phone number i want to help as many people as possible okay <clears throat> And if you can't get a hold of me, it's because these mothers have fired me. <laughs> All right. Thank you. I'll take care of your stuff. It's nothing. It's nothing. Just don't forget your stuff. And um, like I said, just calm down. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, you're so sweet. No, I did this in like four minutes. <laughs>